All right, so that wasn't too bad. Let's see what we need to get done right now. Um, we earned a couple skill points here on this character. Um, I think as far as missions go or progression, we're pretty good. Um, I think this is going to be like the last one for sequence four. I think we're going to have a uh, boss fight here. Um, what I am going to do though is I'm going to switch my character um, if I can just by pressing R3 at this menu. Um, so you press options and you can switch your character. So you can tell I have a lot of ways to go with Eevee. I have 14 skill points. Um, we're going to address some of those quickly before I head on over here um, and probably finish up this part of the actual mission. Uh, let's go look at skills. So I have 12 skills. Uh, looks like I think I can just stack up all of these and unlock every single one. Uh, I'm not really too worried about kidnapping. Um, stealth would be cool. Uh, assassin steps. Yeah, we'll go ahead and drop one into that. Uh, I think I'm going to do a little bit of fighting too. Uh, you can see I'm already level 3, or no, oh, just level 4. Um, the one thing I noticed was, I think it's Jacob, was a higher level than me when I started upgrading the stats in the last episode, um, at least the last part. So we're going to add some health boosts here. That's always good. It's helped me survive some fights. Um, as much as I don't like getting in fights and I like executing people. But either way, we just kind of want to make this work for for us the best we can and trying to find out the right skills here. So I have... Zero? Are those really that expensive? I guess they do cost four, but I thought I had 15 skill points. That's quite a bit, actually. Um, knife Master, I need to be level five. I don't think I have any more skill points, so there's nothing I can really upgrade here. I can't even do the one. All right, let's go um, to inventory and do some upgrading here. Knowing, knowing me, so that's plus, let's see here. So that'd be plus one, plus one. That'd be plus two, plus two, but it needs to be crafted. Uh, can I craft it? Wait a minute. I guess, yeah, let's, uh, let's craft it, can we? Nice. So I got a nice little cane here that's going to do a little bit more damage. Um, the other things that I need, I think there are some cloaks and stuff that I could upgrade to, and I guess we could do that as well. Uh, make my character a little bit better, more sneaky, things like that. Uh, what else am I forgetting? I think that's really it for her. I could do like gauntlets and stuff and see if there's an upgrade in here, but um, all these are going to give me like certain need to be level 5, and this one needs to be crafted for level 2, but I don't think I can do that yet. Alright, so I upgraded enough, and then we can go check the progression log, and check progress tracker, so you guys can see that sequences um, pretty much are almost all complete here. Uh, sequence 4 is 90%, and then we have that one left. Uh, my guess is if I go to this event um, that I marked on the map, at least I should have marked on the map, This will be the last sequence, uh, well, last mission for sequence four. I have a feeling that we're going to have like a boss fight, something similar to that. I really haven't really played it out and tested it, so I'm not sure. Driving at night, too, that's kind of new to me. Uh, I haven't really been doing that around the city. It's pretty dark, though. I'm kind of surprised with like how dark it actually is. But we'll see what happens when we get to this place and kind of go through the mission. Um, the syrup and all the poison and stuff that we kind of went through, this will kind of put some loose ends up, but um, the sooner the better, because then we can start sequence five. And it's kind of interesting to think, like, we're already at sequence four, like, almost completion, and the game's 20-some percent. That's not too bad. It's been a decent amount of time as well, but um, we'll see how quickly we can actually get through this game. What's up, Darwin? Sequence four, overdose, suggested level four. Well, aren't we in luck? What are you doing, man? Let's see what he has to say about this actual mission. I have a feeling it'll be kind of interesting. Mr. Fry, I trust that you had a productive meeting with Mr. Owen. Oh, yes, we had the most wonderful chat. I found out the man behind Starrick's soothing syrup is John Elliotson. Dr. Elliotson, I haven't heard that name in a long while. He was a brilliant heart specialist until he became obsessed with phrenology and mesmerism. It 
ruined his career. Well, how shall we proceed? Oh, with all respect, Mr. Darwin, I believe I should proceed alone. After all, we wouldn't want to attract any unwanted attention. Sounds very wise. Good luck, my boy. Oh, and uh, Mr. Fry, should you find yourself with any free time, please do call on me. All right, so we'll see what happens now. I guess we have to go into uh, this area, but before we do that, I'm gonna use his um, skill points. I figured I might as well upgrade him more and get some interesting stuff here. Um, what's this? I wanna bring an enemy near death. Mm, very useful to set up multi-finishers and other moves. Oh, what do we got here? Must be level five. I don't think I could do that because I need to be level five. Assassin steps, intimidation. I don't really need intimidation though. The loot takedown is kind of whatever, but I guess I'll. I guess we'll go with some stealth here. I think that'll help me out a little bit on this character at least, and I think we'll be good. All right, so let's see what we got here. I think it's just a simple entry point. I don't think we have uh, anything crazy going on, like people guarding. At least it doesn't look that way. I could be wrong. Tell me something. Oh, I need lockpicking too to open those doors. Well, that ain't gonna happen. Don't mind me, guys. I'm just going in on the roof. I think this will be good. Do I have a lockpick to open that? Wow, maybe I should have learned lockpicking. nothing in this room either my question is does it want me to like assassinate people because it wants me to reach the vantage point gonna see me. Wait a minute. It's upstairs, right? Looks like it's upstairs. Kinda. Where would I find the doctor? Yeah, good question. I think we're good to go here. I'm a little bit easier than I expected. Just witness the application of too much pressure can sometimes result in unexpected outcomes. Unfortunately, it appears I've ruined the organ. Send up a cadaver. At once, Dr. Linson. I don't care about your ethics, and I care even less about your damn patience. Now hand over your keys. What are you doing? Haven't you heard? You're fired. Now bugger off. Well, that's different. Um, I like the bloody handprint too. So 
Assassinate John Elliotson. Explore the area. Identify opportunities. Nurse infiltration opportunity. Young doctor. You need kill opportunity. Press L3 with the um, to find out where they are. And R3 to identify them. Alright, so I wonder what the deal with the nurse is and how that's going to work. Um, I think we're going to try that. Looks like there's a basement here. Alright, what do we got here? Not exactly what I had in mind. Alright, nurse, where are you at? Unlocks our doors in the asylum. Well, that could be good. What's the matter? Oh, young man, help. I must speak with Miss Nightingale at once. One of the brutes stole my key, and there's no one around. I can't get out of here. Stole your key? Don't go anywhere. I might be able to do something. Question is, do I need to kill these guys? Especially that. I guess we can. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, they do notice me. Oh, well. I guess we're gonna have a fight. Oh, man, really? The one thing I don't want to do on my day off is fight psychotic ward staff with bats. Yeah, this will be a good combo. Oh man, that is a lot of swinging going on. <laughs> oh man. Oh no. Don't hit me. Don't. No. Oh, he actually got me. I'm gonna dodge these, otherwise, he's gonna kill me. Good dodge. Ah, he ain't doing that. Well, this got a little, uh, I'd say out of hand, um, to say the least. <sighs> Alright, locked doors can now be opened. So I need to go assassinate him. As well as stop the surgery. Right. Alright, so how am I gonna go do this? Hmm, I thought I was just up here. Oh, yeah, it's back this way. Okay. there's an entry point there that I can go up there and stab him in the face. There's got to be an easier way in here. It's just where I came from, huh? Oh, you got to be kidding me. Well, that's different. Hmm. 
I wonder if I could drop like the chandelier on him. Like he's standing right under it, you'd think, right? If I had another knife, like that'd be so easy to do. Well, I don't want to do that, that's for sure. Come on, jump. Oh, free run down, oh my god, why? There's gotta be something I'm missing. Sorry, bud. Hopefully you got a knife on you, because I could use that. Oh, he won't see anything. I'll take that. Didn't I go in here already, or is this the ground floor? So if I go in this door, I'm assuming that's going to be like right behind him. I mean, I guess that works. A little bit different than I thought. At last it ends. Yet I can only think of beginnings. A better tomorrow. Forged with the blood of visionaries. All I see is the blood of a lunatic. <laughs> you truly believe murdering an old man will stop humanity's great architect? Crawford's steric has a glorious design for mankind. Designs are meant to be broken. I hear a child. A child who believes they can solve all the world's woes with a flick of a blade. Have you ever pondered the consequences of your actions, Jacob Fry? Or did your father teach you nothing? Well, that's slightly intimidating, but uh, nonetheless, I think we completed that mission. Uh, I should have went to the basement and actually got that other guy out, but I just assumed I'd take advantage of killing him. However, now the question is, like, or is it going to teleport me out and just say, hey, congratulations, you're done with the cutscene? Um, I guess we'll find out. I guess it wants me to escape the area. So... The other option I had was to uh, go in the basement and uh, halt this electrocution thing, but I don't even know if they're doing that anymore. Oh man, that's a lot of people. No more, no more. I'm not doing it. Nah, no, no, no intruder. Don't mind me. Wait, was that there before? I guess I'm going to lose that part of the mission. Um, I think you have to stop it before. But, I mean, it's not that big of a deal. I'm honestly not too worried about it. We completed the main quest, and that's really all that kind of matters at this point. And uh, we'll hop in here. That's the way. Hey guys, watch out! Crazy guy driving. All right, sequence complete. 
Sequence four, overdose complete. Uh, halt the ex <laughs> electro uh, con convulsive therapy session. Uh, that's the one I did not stop. Uh, I should have probably thought about that beforehand, but I don't think it really matters. It's just a XP bonus and something like that. But either way, that wasn't too bad with completing that part of the sequence. Slow down. That's a girl. All right, so this is going to be kind of different. And it's an expired, and soothing syrup production has ceased. Outrageous! Fry intends to endanger all of London at the hands of the mob. Or perhaps he doesn't intend much of anything at all. Thank He's you. simply content to dice with our lives. The asylum is shut up. Medical care throughout the city is in disarray. He does not, cannot understand the consequences of his actions. The man is clearly an anarchist. Gentlemen. This tea was brought to me from India, by a ship, where it was packaged and ferried by carriage to my door, unpacked in the larder and brought upstairs to me, all by men and women who work for me, who are indebted to me, Crawford Starrick, for their jobs, the time, the very lives they lead. They will work in my factories, and so too shall their children. And you come to me with talk of this Jacob Fry. This insignificant blemish who calls himself assassin. You disrespect the very city that works day and night, so that we may drink this. This miracle, this tea. I'm nearing the end of my research. Our beloved London shall not suffer such a bothersome fool for much longer. And what of this sister I've heard of? Miss Fry? Miss Fry shall be gutted. Soon enough. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs>